have a problem with water science. We don't have uh, very clean water. As you can see, the delta. The people, as you can see, they are bathing inside the river. Then we, <coughs> we fetch water in the river again, of which is not healthy. So the people who, the, the people who, who said maybe they have to provide us water, they constructed some dams, as we can see some tanks, of which uh, they agreed to supply the village in every, or after every, after every week, of which right now they're not actually doing their uh, job. Right? Maybe they can even come a once in a month, of which we are left with uh, no option but to, to drink this water. But these people they need to be briefed on how to carry out uh, to make the water safe to drink. Most of the eastern side of the, the Okavango Panhandle is actually uh, affected by human elephant conflicts and particularly the, the villages of Salonga, Gonotsuha, Eretsa, Beza and Kudigwa. Um, uh, elephants who come in from NG13 in the northern part of uh, the delta uh, come in to drink uh, uh, in, uh, near those villages and uh, along their ways of course there are lots of uh, fields and uh, um, Elephants take advantage of that uh, easy to find food. So there's a lot of uh, uh, elephant damage uh, to crops along uh, those villages. Elephants, yeah, that's the, the main <coughs> the main problem here. Normally, the the elephants they cause a conflict between men, the the people in the in, the, in their fields. So they they, they, they normally distract some farmers fields you can even come up out of the field with nothing and right? then I left with no nothing to for survival yeah we normally use some chilies we had some enumerators who were to to teach farmers on how to carry out chilies around their farms <laughs> Oili. <laughs> There is a project that is supported by World Bank that has been implemented by uh, wildlife in the area and the whole idea is to uh, come up with mechanisms of um, reducing the, the conflict. Uh, this includes one, um, building stronger fences uh, for, for the fields. Secondly, it includes uh, more active uh, participation of uh, farmers in, within their fields so that uh, um, the presence of people usually is um, helps to keep the elephants away. If the elephants know that people are around, it usually helps them. So, uh, vi uh, um, vigilance of the farmers is also one of the things that they're looking at. And the other one is looking at chili peppers, uh, growing chili peppers and helping uh, do chili bombs to scare away the elephants. So, we, will also, uh, we are also working uh, in collaboration with them to look at other ways of um, uh, reducing elephant conflict and this we are uh, using a um, management audited monitoring system where we establish when the elephants actually damage, uh, which fields are most vulnerable, 
when the times at which um, the elephants actually damage um, and the frequency of, of the damage so that we can document all these things and be able to uh, focus and strategize the interventions more specifically uh, with the data that has been collected.